Are you new to Java? Are you having trouble adding and getting user input? Well, by the end of this video, you'll have a fully working Java program to get two numbers from a user and then add them. First, hop into Eclipse, go to File, New Java Project. We'll call this something like adding. And we will throw a new class in here. We'll say uh, adding again. Public static void and hit finish. To add numbers in Java is very, very simple. All you have to do is do like five plus 10. And the reason there's an error is because we need to put this somewhere. So what we can do is we can just print it out to the screen with this code right here, save it, run it, and we'll see those two numbers printed out into this console window. Now to get input from a user, we can do that really easily with code that Java built for us, and that's called a scanner. So we'll just type scanner, we'll name it. I usually like to call mine scan, and we'll say equals new Scan. Since this is code Java wrote for us, we need to tell it, hey, we're going to be using it. Let's bring it into our program by clicking import scanner. And to access that, you just hover over scanner. Now this is underlined because it's saying, well, where do you want me to get this information from? Well, we want to get it from this console window and the console window is just system.in. Now we'll just ask the user for the first number since we need to add for ask for one number and then a second number and then add them. So we gotta get the first number. So let's let them know that they need to enter a number. And we'll save it, run it. We'll see that message to enter a number, but I can't add anything yet. And that's because we're not using the scanner yet. So just call it by typing the name of your scanner and then a dot to bring up what it can do. And it can do all these things, um, but we're just gonna type next int like this. This gets the integer that we type in. We'll store that into a variable called a, and we'll just, uh, to test this, if it's working right, we'll just print out that value. So we'll save it and run it. It says enter a number, we'll enter like eight, hit enter, and then we get that eight returned to us. So it's working. Now we just need to get this one more time and then add them. So I'm just gonna copy what we did before and we'll say enter another number and we'll name it the second number to B. And to finish it off, we'll add the two together by printing out A plus B. Save it, run it. We'll enter say nine and then enter number number, another number like 14 and we get 23 as the addition. So let's just recap what we did since this kind of looks confusing. First, what we did was we're saying, hey, we wanna get input from a user let's use this thing called a scanner, which makes it really easy. And let's throw it into our program. Let's ask the user for a number. We'll store that number into A. Let's ask them for a second number and store that into B. And finally, we'll print on the screen A plus B. So I hope this was helpful. If it was, please smash that like button and share it if you think it might help someone you know. I wish you all the best for 2019. Thanks for all the support you've given this channel and I'll catch you later. See ya.